12.43. It, uh, it was an 8 today, 8 hour day. I thought it was going to be a 10, uh, at least a 10, maybe a 12, but it wasn't, so, I mean, that's okay. Uh, construction Stories Part 42. Hmm. Let's just say freaking cold, okay? So, I've already been over how cold it gets here. I've already been over how it's very chilly, and um, I'm just going to rehash that. It is really freaking cold. We are on on a waterway, and there's not a lot of trees around, and the trees that are there aren't made to stop wind, and it's a huge flat expanse of concrete, and I'm sorry, not concrete, but asphalt, that opens up into a basin, and the wind is like open the air sweet and just shoots through the uh, the asphalt area which, which we call the yard and it's also the wind just goes and swirls around the basin so it, it's ridiculously cold so we found um, I guess I found out that they were talking about how it was 15 degrees and I mean Fahrenheit and I know that's not that cold if you live in like Montana or Nevada or Antarctica or Alaska, or those places that are actually kind of built around being cold, but when the average temperature is like 40s and 50s, 15 degrees Fahrenheit is pretty chilly. So, like, that's that. But plus the wind chill factor, so wind, like it's the normal temperature, and then the wind hits you and takes away your heat, and that's that contributes, that less, that lowers the heat cold, whatever, I don't know. So it ended up being around like, I don't know, 9 degrees Fahrenheit or something tonight. It was really cold. Like, we get there, I have a brisk walk out, I'm like, <laughs> whoo, and I get in the shop and we talk, the Connex, and we talk about what we're going to do, and then we're like, okay, and then we go out. As soon as I got out and started walking back this way towards the warehouse, the warehouse, the wind was like, and I was like, and my lips like instantly dried out and my eyes were starting to water and my fingers lost all sense of feeling and it was just really intense and I hadn't planned on it being that cold so I wasn't wearing the proper gloves nor another layer like I should have been and that just sucked but it was it was still a fun night it was cool I got M&M's M&M's make everything better Skittles uh, you know and what do we do? We just, we, Amber and I pretty much set up shop in the warehouse and drilled holes in the PEX pipe for the water cure. So it was, it was nice. Then after that, we just picked wire for about two hours. It was an okay night. Nothing really crazy happened, but it was just really ridiculously cold. And I don't think I can stress how much it, it just, it just feels really weird when you step outside and your face feels like the outside of your face feels like it's going to fall off just from being really cold. So they said that tomorrow was going to be colder. And then they also said that next week it was going to be rainy. So snow is one thing. But being in Washington, it, it, for some reason it's really good at being really cold and raining at the same time without being snow. Which is really freaking stupid because I like snow. And... I don't know. I'm just mad. Um, I'm going to go take a shower and thaw out my fingers. And I hope you have a wonderful night. Um, I'm going to go to bed. Good night, guys.